Hey guys, what's up? This is Castro5661 and I'm coming to you today with a website review. This is a fun website I've been using for a while. It's called Peter Answers. Now, if you guys don't know what Peter Answers is, it's a website where you ask a guy named Peter, I guess. You ask him a question and he'll, he'll answer it. Now, if you don't if you know what it is and they've pulled this prank on you because it is a prank, then now you're going to know how they did it and you'll be able to use it on anyone else such as you know you can do this with your kids, coworkers, family, friends, your boss. If he's cool, if he's not cool, don't do it. I don't want you to get fired and then come back and blame me for it. All right, now how it works is you make a petition right here. Now the petition you have to write Peter please answer or Peter please answer the following question. And once you write that in, you type your question and you, after you type the your question, you hit question mark and he'll give you an answer. Let me close this. And he'll give you an answer. And he'll answer the question right depend if the person that's doing this to you knows how to use it. Like my name's Cody. So I'm going to type Peter Peter, please answer. Semicolon. Once you hit semicolon, it'll take you down to the question, and you say, "What is my name?" That's going to be my question. Once you hit the question mark, you hit, I accept. Cody, he answered my name right. Now the secret behind this is, in the petition, how you how it works, you hit period. See. A, a P appeared right now, but I hit the period. You know, that the period, little dot, that end sentences, you hit period. And then you type the answer to the question you're going to ask. So, what's my YouTube username? That's, say that's going to be our question. After I hit period, I'm going to type my, user, us, my YouTube username. As you guys know, it's Castro5661. But instead, I typed Castro5661 in. But right here, you guys see that it says, Peter, please answer. So the person that's watching you do this is thinking that you're ty typing Peter please answer because they're going to be focused on the screen they're not going to be focused on what you're typing. And after you after you're done typing in the answer Oh, I'm sorry about this guys. Let me just keep my color scheme. Not answer that again. <laughs> okay. So after you type your answer in right here, you're going to hit period again. And what that's going to do is it's going to take you out of that little phase where you write your answer. And now you actually have to type again. See, now if I type whatever, it's not going to type whatever anymore. Now you actually have to put, please answer. You just finish it off depending how long it is. Like if it's a long answer, you're going to write, Peter, please answer the following question. If it's a short answer, you could just put, Peter, please answer. Now I put my YouTube username right there. It's hidden in the, in the petition. So now what is my... YouTube username question mark and it answers it Castro5661 now you guys got that right if if you're a person and someone asks you to do this now you guys are gonna know how and you're gonna be like no nah, I already know that trick you can't pull it on me and if you know some people who don't know about this website and go for it have some fun let's I'll show you guys one more time one more walkthrough so you guys can get it all right in the petition you're going to answer the question. I don't want to confuse you guys right there. So whatever question you're about to ask, right now you're going to write the answer in the petition. You're, and you're going to start that by hitting period, like the ones that you put at the end of a sentence. And then you write your answer. What color, like Let's say the question is going to be, what color shirt am I wearing? I'm going to say white. As I type white, it types Peter. I'm typing W-I-T-E. But it types Peter so that it disguises it in in the petition. And once you're done typing your answer, you're going to hit another period. You're going to type one more period, as in the end of a sentence. And then from there on out, you have to write the rest of the petition. See, since it are it's already at that point, I'm going to put please um oh see oh please answer. See, after you type the your answer and you hit the period, you actually got to finish off the petition. You hit semicolon, it'll take you to the question. What color is my shirt? And once you hit the question mark, well, after you ask your question, you hit the question mark, white. And it answers it. Now you can do this with your friends. Say, watch, 
I bet you this site will know your name. I bet you this site will know the color of your shirt, what type of shoes you're wearing, and you guys could trick them. Now, if you like this video, um, comment, rate, subscribe. And if you have any questions about it, be sure to put them in the comment. I will answer any questions you guys have about this video. And be sure to check out my giveaway I have going on right now, guys. It's about to end. I have 23 subscribers right now. It ends at 25, so you guys can get in while you still can. And after this one's done, I have some products on the way for unboxing, review, and giveaway. So be sure to stay tuned on my, on my channel. Make sure you subscribe. Check out my other videos. And if you like them, you know, subscribe. <laughs> Alright, well that's it. This is PeterAnswers.com. I hope you guys try this out on whoever you want to play around. And you guys know me, Castro5661. Peace.